my rhymes this time, seek your mind to blow it. Have you ever been cranially assaulted by a poet flowing? I got words cast like bricks that I'm throwing. I'm opening up the gray matter of the unsuspecting below and showing it to the light of day and that radioactive glow. I dip these words in uranium and I use them to split the cranium. I take a whole stadium subterranean and we build in new civil structures like we're fucking Mesopotamian. Listen, this is not about the man and the good he may or may not do. It's about the power being concentrated in the hands of far too few. It's about me being just as sick of a two-party system as you, but too scared to not vote against the devil that I knew on behalf of my kids, and I do believe that love can conquer all, but I'm also convinced that pride fucking goeth before a fall. Can't you fuckers see the writing on the wall? For a moment... I thought I saw a light flicker, but that was probably just the neon up above the corner liquor inviting you to come on in, forget about this endless war that we can't win. You let the sedation begin again from the beginning, never mind where ten runs down in the bottom of the ninth inning. Have a beer, forget about these police that's pinning motherfuckers down by their necks while they grinning. I don't want to fight with bullets. We all know that that shit's been done. But sometimes, an oppressed people's love can only speak through the barrel of a gun. It's like when the population stagnates and the social conscious spoils, you begin to see atrocities daily like trading blood for oil. You got 10,000 kids that work AKs although they'd rather work the soil, but when you got an occupying force on your block like a snake that's coiled, do you like the party line or do you strike out in honor of your ancestors stretching across time and space to occupy this place? This barren patch of earth where they have bled and sweat and died and given birth only to find their homes raised by carpet bombs. Those are bombs that bring freedom, and that's a freedom that kills. I can only imagine that's a handful of bitter pills, and yet you still wonder why they lining up on the streets to sharpen their skills. You'd do it too if they no knocked they asses into your crib, stuck a Glock in your face, accidentally on purpose murdered your kid. You see the bodies of your folks in such profusion they could build a fucking pyramid, and you want to see your aggressors suffer like you did. I'm not saying that I want to fight with bullets. Because Martin and Medgar and Gandhi all know that that shit's been done, but sometimes... When they come for you and yours, when they draft your sons and daughters into endless empire-building wars, when they stack in bodies by the fucking scores, when they kicking in your doors, I said sometimes, our love can only speak through the barrel of a gun.